Hello and welcome to the Z Hut. Today I'd like to show you how you can fill your little portable air tank super fast. Now normally to fill these there's a little valve stem and usually right next to it's the valve to turn your air off and on to your hose and you'd use one of these you'd put it on the air line stick it on there and sit and wait about two minutes for it to fill and I just got sick and tired of just sitting and waiting for these things to fill when I needed to use them. I got to thinking and I came up with this nifty little thing. This has the same connections on it, air fittings, and I got one that had male threads and one that had female threads, screwed them together. What you do is take Put one end, and you'd want to put it on the tank you're filling the end first, and take your air compressor. And I can hear it filling, and it's just about full. And I'd say she's... And I pulled the wrong end off first, of course. You want to take the end off of the air tank first. Now, it was almost full. I guess I was wrong. It's about 30 seconds to fill it this way. But using this, it takes like two, three minutes. I know that. And doing it this way is way quicker. Plus, I also had my air compressor turned off, and it was about half full. So normally it would fill faster. Now one thing you want to be careful of, now I have my air compressor set at a low enough pressure that this tank will handle it. But some air compressor, compressors and shops and gas stations are going to be cranked way up and you could blow your tank. So you're going to want to keep an eye on your gauge. Now unfortunately the gauge is busted off of mine and I just put a, another socket on there to add an air hose to but I never fill this anywhere except at home. So I wasn't too worried about the, the gauge missing. But you're gonna wanna be careful of that. So if you try this little trick, um, please do it at your own risk. The chances of anything happening, I mean, if the tank is gonna blow up, it'd probably blow up even if you're using a regular filler, as long as you were staying under the pressure it's rated for. And this tank, uh, or it says somewhere on here, 125 PSI, and my air compressor is set at 100. So I can fill this, I can put this on, walk away, come back, and not worry about any problems with it blowing up. That and the tank isn't all rusted. It's just a little dirty. All right, um, well, I hope you found this information useful. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. I'd appreciate it. So thanks for joining us here at the Z Hut today. Have a great day.